My friend bought a used car for five thousand dollars. He thought he had made a huge profit, but when he got home, he discovered that the car had a strange malfunction, and now it can't be returned. And then the fans found me. I'm here today with the tools to see if I can fix it quickly. Let's start. The fault looks like this. Look. Apply the brakes. Start the car. Did you see that? Can't start. Try again. Very weird. Can be started. What do you think is the cause? Let's go take a look at the front cabin. The owner spent three thousand dollars at the repair shop. Updated petrol pump. Cleaned the fuel injection nozzle. Replaced spark plug. More than that, it also replaces the sensor. But the fault is still not solved. Report repairs to the official. The repair shop said the fault was very complicated. All precision parts must be inspected. Fans have no choice but to come to me. Ask me to help him fix this complex fault. I promised him I could fix it. In fact, as long as you understand the principle of the fault, it is very simple to solve it. There are generally three reasons why the car won't start: oil circuit, accessories replaced, electric circuit, spark plug replaced, gas circuit. It changed the sensor. But there is one part. I guess he must have forgotten to check. Come here. Look, that's it. It is the camshaft position sensor. Let's take it apart. Removing it is easy. Unplug this plug first. Then find a tool to remove this screw. This gadget is very cheap and available everywhere. Okay, the screws have already been removed. Pull it out, and the sensor can be taken out. Okay, the cause of the fault was found. Come and see. My gosh, the sensor head is full of iron filings and sludge. Too much iron filings will affect the accuracy of the sensor. Where did these iron filings come from? Maybe that the engine has not been maintained properly, so it is worn out. The sensor is magnetic and attracts worn iron filings. Let's ignore the maintenance of the engine first. First, solve the problem of it being difficult to start. Replacing new parts is not necessarily the best solution. Spread paper towels on the floor. Use a bottle of cleaning agent to clean the sludge on the sensor head. Wow, really too dirty. Cleaning agents can be bought at auto parts stores. If the iron filings cannot be washed away, wipe them with paper. What? Did you see that? Okay, clean up completed. It looks like new. Now the sensor has been cleaned. Then install it back. Very easy. Install according to the disassembly steps. Align it with this hole and press it down. Okay, and then tighten the screws. This sensor is an absolutely fixed sensor. As the camshaft rotates, it generates a signal and sends it to the computer board, which determines the top dead center of the piston for fuel injection and ignition. So many iron filings will affect the accuracy of its judgment. So sometimes the car starts, sometimes it doesn't. Okay. Finally, put the plug back in. Now all the parts have been installed. Next, I'll get in the car and see if it can start. Hey, bro! If the fault is solved, please light up the little red heart to support me. The next step is to witness the miracle of the moment. Pay attention. Break. Three, two, one. Start up. Start smoothly. Did you see it? Let's try it again. Very perfect. Press the gas pedal. Look, very powerful. This complex glitch、Ooh. has been completely fixed. It's really simple, right? Follow me to make a friend who knows cars.